Hello everyone. We are back to do our test route two. This is coming from my parents. We're gonna see how uh, six dot no ten dot six dot one is different. Good. This is exactly what it should do on this stop. Exactly what it should do. Instead of coast and jury, that's that's exactly what it should do. Um so this might be different. I haven't decided yet. It depends on how we're gonna edit it. Um, I have not posted as of right now um, the video for 10.6. And um, I'm not sure if I wanna just kinda like compare both of those at the same time or if we want to just upload them both and just compare it that way. I am probably a minimum gonna I think I'm just gonna upload them both. Maybe before this, I'll upload the 10.6, and then right after, I'll upload this one, have both on the same day, just so you can compare them pretty easily. Uh, so that's gonna be uh, interesting to see the differences so close to each other. You can just watch them side by side for that, man. Actually, I'll probably upload them at the same time. So you'll watch them, you can watch them side by side. We'll see how it goes. Um, well, I guess this is going to be a little bit different. I'm actually, uh, dude, Sergey says I'm going to stop real quick past all these, but I am going to go. It's going to be 90% the same test, or 98% the same test. So we're going to go ahead and go there and see how it does. Still trying to stop at that stop sign, unfortunately. It, <laughs> well, you see what that did? It's because I held down the accelerator. Uh, it will. It still will not turn on the blinker to get over. It'll just kind of read the curb and just kind of merge over. It won't ever turn on the blinker to get over in that lane for some reason. That was a disengagement. Okay, we're gonna get rid of this light here. Um, it still repeatedly get, gets that. I am feeling this map data has not been updated since that's been redone. That was redone weeks ago, uh, week, well, I mean, months ago that that lane was redone for the high school here. And it's still not on this map. It decides to interesting. So it decides to get in the left lane for once. It still doesn't read the speed limit sign. The only reason it changes here is because of map data. Let's go ahead and See if we can snapshot that every time. I, I don't know how to, like, maybe disengage. Maybe I'll break now. I I don't know how to get them to fix that. It, I have multiple areas where the car just does not read the speed limit sign. And they're not, like, the weird, unique, special speed limit signs. They're, they're normal, everyday speed limit signs. It just does not read the sign. I actually decided not to get all these and we'll do that maybe tomorrow next day of the week um, but yeah that stop was very smooth to go down uh, considering how fast we were going Still takes the exit too late. But at least to turn the blinker on. It's here 
to these cars coming on the highway and allow these cars it slowed down appropriately and allow these cars to get merged on so I canceled that lane change ultimately because one I knew this car was speeding up two I know we're about to lower our speed limit down to 60 because of the 55 up ahead so there's no point in my opinion to change lanes and then get back over because this car is speeding up supposed to do when a car stops on the side of the road like that you're supposed to change lanes and then you get back over like this I believe it's actually a law in North Carolina to do that besides just being common courtesy to give that that vehicle and person room got this truck stopped on the side here Maybe really should have pulled off the road further, but yeah. Um, see how it does here. Honestly, this drive didn't really f feel any different than 10.6 for me. Um, same mistakes, and yeah, I believe 10.6 actually was zero disengagement because this couple, this couple areas didn't um, like. I think I kind of forced it over in the. I made interventions in a way that prevented the disengagements, essentially. Otherwise, um, yeah, this uh, it's a good drive overall. Uh, I'm still looking for those improvements. Um, mainly, it's map data, everyone, map data. Con speed limit's 45. It's the wrong speed limit on this road. Constant map issues in this area, I think, would solve most of my problems. Uh, and a lot of other areas would solve most issues if it had good map data. Um, but yeah, we'll see when that ever that happens. If you have any questions for me, put them in the comments down below. Uh, if you like this video, go ahead and give me a like down below as well. Uh, and otherwise, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks everyone. Bye.